welcome to the 2016 NPC IFBB Pro-Am show in Shreveport, Louisiana, Optimum Classic. I'm here with Whitney Shipman, who placed fourth in the bikini division. Thank you for being here, Whitney. This is her first show. Whitney, we're so proud of you. And tell us how you got involved tonight in bikini competitions. I had seen a show a couple of months ago and was interested in it. And the reason that I wanted to do this was, um, although this is personal, before I had been abused in previous relationships. And I wanted to use this as to be a stepping stone for other women who have been abused to feel like they can be and do whatever they put their mind to. So it's a control, your control of your own body? Yes, I am. Okay, and so um, how, how many weeks out did you prepare for this event? I started in January. I was training before actually for a strong man and I switched over into bikini. So strong man, which, which division in strong man? Like how was the training different from strong man to bikini? Oh, in strong man it was eat a lot and lift heavy. <laughs> and bikini, um, I started bulking, was eating more and building muscle and lifting heavier then, but then it went to higher reps and you know, everything changed. So how does your uh, work lifestyle fit in with your training? I would always um, teach, I teach, so I would get off after teaching all day and I would go train and then go home and start over and do it all over again. So now that you've been here at your first show, tell us the feeling that you have and will you compete again? I'm just excited that I was even able to walk on stage and that I'm in the best shape of my life and that I have the health that I have right now and yes, I will compete again. So what advice would you give other women maybe in your shoes that contemplate competing but they just haven't done it yet? They should do it. They should not even have any doubts in their mind. If they want to do something, they should go do it and rock it. Even if you don't win or place, go on stage and have fun. The last question I have is what keeps you motivated? We all have our good days and bad days. So what keeps you pushing to get that workout in or stick to that diet? What motivates you to keep on? Uh, my past um, of not being healthy and not feeling good about myself and wanting to prove to myself that I can achieve my goals. So how do you feel now that you've been taking care of yourself? I feel tons better physically, mentally, just everything's all better. <laughs> Well, great. Congratulations and thank you again, Whitney. Thank you.